Narcissists are great pretenders and expert liars. They created a false self that is flawless and blameless. In short, perfect. Narcissists cover up their inadequacies, insecurities, fears, and imperfections with their fancy masks. Many people are fooled by the narcissist's filtered charm or charisma, but not the super empaths. Super empaths can uncover narcissists' hidden identity, known as expert mind readers and body language interpreters. Watch until the end as I show you 10 ways how super empaths remove the narcissist's mask. Number one, super empaths' empathetic nature can break down the narcissist's defenses. Super empaths have a vast understanding of human behaviors. Instead of judging other people, especially narcissists, for their undesirable behaviors, super empaths would try to analyze why these people are misbehaving. Backed up by their highly empathetic nature, Super empaths can break down the guards of narcissists. Super empaths can make narcissists feel that they are understood instead of being judged. Super empaths will create a safe space between them and the narcissists where all feelings and opinions are validated. As a result, some narcissists will show their true selves to super empaths, including their weaknesses, trauma, insecurities, etc. This is how super empaths remove the narcissists' masks in a humanitarian way. Number two, super empaths listen to their intuition when talking to a narcissistic person. Super empaths are highly intuitive individuals. Super empaths can sense if there is something off in a person, place, or event through their intuition. Super empaths can uncover the narcissist's true identities by listening more to their intuition than to the narcissist's deceitful word. Furthermore, super empaths are keen observers and excellent listeners. They can pick up strange bodily cues and weird changes in the person's tone of voice they are talking to. Super empaths can also mentally jot down notes of specific keywords that come out of another person's mouth, which they can use to detect a person's hidden agenda and establish the truth. Number three, super empaths expose narcissists' true colors to warn others. Super empaths may be naturally kind, compassionate, and soft-spoken individuals. Still, they can be blunt in their words sometimes when they need to defend themselves and warn others from possible harm that they might incur mentally, emotionally, and physically. When super empaths remove the masks of narcissists by exposing their true colors to other people, they are not doing this through smear campaigns. It is not the nature of super empaths to ruin other people's image, including narcissists. Super empaths only have a sense of responsibility to inform others about an impending danger. They just want to use their intuitive abilities to save themselves and others. Number four, super empaths deflate narcissists' inflated egos. Narcissists are arrogant, loud, and proud individuals. Their high self-esteem is just a cover-up for their insecurities fears, and inadequacies. Narcissists are so desperate to be superior to others, they regard other people as inferiors. They want to boast about their achievements and good deeds to prove to others that they are brilliant people with a heart for humanity. Super empaths take off their fancy masks to awaken narcissists from their delusional sense of grandiosity by deflating their inflated egos. Super empaths do not do this to maliciously drag down narcissists but only to bring their feet back on the ground. Narcissists should not play with gravity. As high as narcissists try to exalt themselves, gravity has its way of pulling them back down to where they should be. Will narcissists ever learn the principle of humility? Number five, super empaths do not submit to narcissists' made up sovereignty. Narcissists fantasize about themselves as persons in authority or people with royal blood. They are so bossy because they demand obedience and respect from other people through threats, coercion, or manipulation. Narcissists think highly of themselves and regard others as their slaves. Their greed for power is so great that they can do everything just to acquire it, even if it takes stepping on other people's rights, dignity, or reputation. They can even give up their relationships to advance from their current status. Super empaths remove narcissists' masks by rebelling against their made-up sovereignty. The unsubmissive behavior of super empaths prove that narcissists do not have any power over them. Just a quick question. 
How can narcissists effectively use their powers, if ever they had any, when they cannot even act responsibly? I bet some of you are familiar with the old saying from the film Spider-Man that with great power comes with great responsibility. Narcissists' only concern is just to be in the spotlight. They do not care about other people. Does this sound like a good and effective leader to you? Number 6. Super Empaths Can Sense The Narcissist's Fears Super Empaths' high sensitivity levels can sense the narcissist's fears even if they try to conceal and cover them up with their inflated egos and filtered courage. Super Empaths will make narcissists realize that they are just like other typical people with some fears. Super Empaths will use narcissists' fears not to intentionally take them down, but to somehow comfort them that it is okay to be afraid and be vulnerable in front of the right and trusted people. Super Empaths remove the narcissist's masks by uncovering their fears and helping them overcome those in the right ways. However, with narcissists' high self-esteem and pride, will they even admit that they have fears? Super Empaths cannot effectively help narcissists become better people if these egocentrics cannot even face their fears as they are trying so hard to deny them. Number 7. Super Empaths Do Not Offer Narcissists With Flatteries Narcissists crave flatteries and compliments that other people can offer them. By hearing other people's words of flattery, they can confirm that they are indeed praiseworthy. Narcissists will feel euphoric every time people give them positive feedback. However, they cannot accept constructive criticism aimed at self-improvement. In the minds of narcissists, there is nothing to improve within themselves since they think that they are already perfect. Super empaths remove the narcissists' masks by not offering them the flatteries they crave. Super empaths can only give genuine compliments to other people whose actions are truly commendable. I have two questions that I want to be answered by narcissists. First, can narcissists distinguish true praises from false ones? Second, do narcissists feel happy even if they receive fake flatteries? Number 8. Super empaths do not let narcissists influence their minds. Super empaths are not strangers to the manipulative tactics of narcissists. With their highly intuitive and observant nature, super empaths can read between the lines and decrypt hidden meetings and agendas behind the fancy and filtered words that narcissists are throwing at them. Since they are great pretenders, they are experts at acting like good people to gain empaths' trust, sympathy, and affection, their favorite targets as they are the perfect sources of their narcissistic needs. Super empaths who are good at setting up healthy boundaries deflect narcissists' manipulation, deception, and pretensions. This is how super empaths remove narcissists' masks to expose their abusive and exploitative nature. Number 9. Super empaths teach narcissists how to treat people appropriately. Super empaths expose narcissists' lack of values and respect for other humans. Despite narcissists' extraordinary efforts to display good characters, super empaths can still detect their narcissistic tendencies. When people look, narcissists try to do good deeds and behave appropriately. However, when narcissists' mission to discard, abuse, and bully their victims begins to manifest into actions, they ensure that no witnesses can ever see their evil deeds. Super Empaths, aware of the narcissist's true identity, even before carrying out their schemes, will instinctively teach narcissists how to treat people appropriately. By teaching narcissists how to behave well with others, Super Empaths remove narcissists' masks. Number 10. Super Empaths Will Not Take the Blame for the Mistakes of Narcissists Narcissists are very quick to own their deeds if it means receiving rewards, merits, or praises. However, they are incapable of taking accountability for their actions if all they will be getting is punishment. When they mess up in their schemes, narcissists tend to route their blame for their faults to other people to avoid public humiliation, penalty, and other forms of disciplinary actions. Narcissists are experts at victim role-playing by producing crocodile tears and deploying smear campaigns against the actual victims. 
Super empaths remove the narcissist's masks by exposing their offenses to achieve the ends of justice. Super empaths are experts in reading other people's personalities, especially narcissists. Due to their vast understanding of human behaviors backed up by their abilities such as being highly intuitive, observant, and empathetic. Therefore, narcissists should never mess with super empaths lest they want their true identities exposed to other people.